Welcome everyone, Josh here with Enemy Impact, we got some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Dueling Leaks. The leaks are strong today. The force is with us today, let me tell you what. We got a new leaked image here. Uh, it shows some of the cards that we already got from the new tagged uh, duel event, which I already went over in my live stream. If you have not checked it out, definitely go check that video out. I went in detail of all of that event. However, we got some new cards in here that are not yet in the game, and they are not showcased in the new structure deck leak that I already made as well on the channel. So that means they may come either in a new mini box, they could come in the card trader, which that's what my opinion is, is that they may come in the card trader. Now, the new cards I'm referring to is we got a new SR coming, we have a new UR coming, and another rare coming, uh, which is really, really cool. And we're going to talk about some of those here right now and how they can actually change the meta not so much the first two we're going to talk about but the third one for sure i'm saving the best for last all right anyways so the first card we got here is kinetic soldier kinetic soldier is a machine effect 1350 attack 1800 defense machine when this card battles with a warrior type monster increase the attack and defense of this monster by 2000 points only during damage calculation now of course if you're playing against an amazonas or an anki user with Destiny Heroes, this could be a big beat stick. Like, you're talking 3,350 attack or 3,800 defense. Now, this card could do some really, really, really cool shenanigans uh, if you play them as like a stall card, if you're playing against those two types of cards, for example. But, uh, eh, I don't know. It's very situational because you're going to have to be playing against those two types of decks right now in the current meta for it to be for you to really take advantage of it. So, it's a very situational card, but, I mean, if we had, like, an all-warrior meta at some point, you know, one day, and then, hey, why not, right? So, let's go into the next one. Asleep at the Switch. Now, this is the rare. Uh, when your opponent gains life points, target one monster your opponent controls, destroy that target. So, there's some situations where you can actually make your opponent gain free life points, but, like, Reign of Mercy, for example. Reign of Mercy with Asleep at the Switch, you know, that's a combo. It's not the greatest card. Uh, it's pretty cool. It could even work with the new uh, dragon that we showcased, the new um, material dragon that I uh, talked about in my last stream. So definitely go check that out. Uh, so there's that combo. But what we need to talk about is the new SR trap that's coming. I'm hoping these are coming as a card trader card. And this new trap that we're getting ready to talk about could potentially be used in so many decks. This literally could be a staple in the current meta as it is now, uh, pre-structured deck, pre-new box set. But, wow, let's talk about it. So we are getting Debunk. Debunk is a counter trap card. When a monster effect is activated in the hand or graveyard, negate the activation. If you do, banish it. So guess what? Banish Rose Lover. Banish Carrot. Banish Karibo. Banish Golden Ladybug. Banish Chaos Hunter. Banish, banish, banish. Insanity. Now, of course, if they get a Koma Shroom off and they do like several things in the graveyard, you can only hit one. But still, like that is extremely powerful, uh, especially if you're a Sylvan player and you're running this in your deck to counter other Sylvans or other decks. This banishes Celestial, so now you don't get that free two, uh, two draw off of your Destiny Hero Celestial from the grave. Like this could do so much in the current meta. It's insanity. This is this is huge. This is This is absolutely huge. Um, this could be a trap that you'll see at least one, two, or even three in almost everyone's deck. Uh, like I said, granted, we're talking about the current meta. The meta could completely shift in the next few weeks and be completely different, and then this trap may not see as much play. But as the current meta stands, right now, at this very time, at this very moment, this card is amazing. This card could do so much, but it could also... Uh, make them may make the meta maybe a little bit more tilty. I don't know because now a lot of decks are countering each other and it's just like oh my god. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this quick little leak video. Again, this is my second one for the day. I don't know if we're gonna hit a third. We'll see. We'll see if the leak gods are shining bright on us today. But anyway, so you guys enjoyed that. Make sure you join the Discord and the description below. I don't know why I said and in the description below as well as subscribe if you're new becoming an impact player today. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your day as always. Until next time. Peace.